Hello everyone and welcome to another Walking Dead video. Last episode, we um, had that dairy farm and it really didn't turn out good in the end. I knew it and we moved on and now we have this episode to do. And then there's around every quarter. And no top. There's two more episodes left. Oh yeah, and the the special DLC. Uh, but seriously, okay, okay, we're gonna we're gonna do this. All right, I will try and do like thirty minute long videos, um, or something like that. I I'll try. I'll try. I don't know because the longer the video, the more time it'll take to upload. All right, just please understand that, guys. I'm trying real hard, so. I will continue! Yay! Let's see what's it got in store for us. Previously on The Walking Dead. Get the gates open! We've got wounded! I want to know why you thought bringing more mouths to feed was a good idea. Word's getting out that you want to leave the motor in. Well, here isn't doing us any good. You should think about coming with us, you and Clem. No one's trying to cut you out of anything. Those look like the people who raided my Calm camp. Calm down, you're paranoid. Fuck you! Did you tell anyone out there who you were, or that you were tied to this place? That's right. I know who you are, and I know you're a killer. He's not dead! Somebody help me! Come on! We know this guy's not gonna make it! Kenny! What the fuck? Sounds like a car. There's a shitload of food and supplies back here. You're right. We shouldn't take this. The rest of us are taking this stuff. Don't worry, little girl. Bandit's got their eye on that dairy. As long as they keep getting food from them, you'll be safe. Okay, I actually didn't need to explain it. <clears> throat> My throat hurts. <clears throat> okay, let's continue this. I still have like a sore throat if you guys didn't tell, so. The Walking Dead. Oh, she. Looks like this is our lucky day. This might actually go smoothly. We deserve it after last time. No, we're back here. Oh, man. You made up your mind yet? About what? When it comes to the getting the hell out of Macon, I bet you're in the let's stay put camp considering I've been pushing everyone to leave. We should go. Motel's run its course, and it's not safe. Well, if that's what you think, you should probably fucking speak up. Lily's dug in. And there goes my family being okay, in arguments. Just like last time. Over the rig, into the pharmacy, and scrape together whatever supplies are left. We Don't they know I'm there. recording here? Hey, we're out of options. Something's better than nothing. Shit. 
You okay? The ladder's come loose. I'm not sure how many more trips she's got in her. I'm not sure how many more trips we've got in us. No kidding. Well, I don't think that's gonna work anymore. <clears throat> Can try, but I don't expect it to. Yep. Looks like she's had it. What now? I'll find another way up. Better get a move on. This is a. Uh... Oh. What happened? Oh, the plane crashed through it. So much for the military. They're blocked by all the fallen concrete. Oh, is there a way to see like Doug somewhere? They're blocked by all the fallen concrete. He's not doing so good, huh? You murdered her dad. I did what I had to, and you know it. stuff out of that car last week. I haven't asked. You even talk to that girl anymore? <laughs> Duck was asking about that guy at Herschel's farm last night. Really? I wasn't sure it phased him. Of course it did. What'd he say? He wanted to know if Herschel's son somehow made it. Pretty sure he knows he didn't. Don't worry. You made out like a hero in his eyes. It's not like that. You're sure you're up for this? Lee, I'm fine. I've got this. Give me your hand. Uh, oh, oh, shit! Oh, fucking... Uh... Next time I'm bringing Ben. Help me get up. No! No! Go away! Go! Go! Help me! Somebody help me! Oh God! Oh God! What the? What the hell is that? A walker? Walkers don't scream, do they? Jesus! I don't think so. Gotta do something. Oh, she's bitten. There we go. End of it all. Gotta shoot her. Put her out of this misery. No, we're here. What do you mean? I mean, we leave her alive and she draws them all to her. Buying us time. Yeah, think about it. We're always worrying about the ones we can't see. She stays alive and brings them all out of their holes. No, I'm not gonna shoot her. That's actually pretty smart. Leave her. She's bitten. And no use helping her. It's just gonna attract them to us. Damn, this girl has a bunch of energy. We 
should be good to clear this place out, but we ain't got all day. Get everything you can out of these racks. Don't forget underneath the counter this time. I'll Jesus, go this, we gotta go. this girl screams a lot. Oh, she stopped. She's gone. There's not much time now. I think that's everything. That girl didn't die for nothing then. Up and over. Yes. We're still clear. Let's hustle. Oh shit. Help me! Help me! Kenny? Kenny? Pilot. What was that? They're everywhere. You took care of yourself, didn't you? Oh, I see that now. The now that we killed those uh, bandits. I mean, not the bandits, not the dairy farm guys. Uh, the those bandits are now attacking us. You're back. Ben found some stickers in a drawer, and I put them on my walkie. Aww. Hey, That's neat. I'll find you in a minute. Looks like we got the kid on watch again. What'd you get? We might as well leave a sign out that says the men are gone. Come and rape our women and children. Ha. Huh. So, what did you get? A lot of stuff. We're fine, by the way. Nice work. This'll keep us going. If we carry on like this, we'll get through the winter here. The winter? We'll freeze our asses off here. Because piling into an RV with you after what you did to my dad is so appealing. Why wouldn't it be? You know I'll do what it takes to keep everyone safe. We're already safe. Take a look at the wall, Lily. That's not graffiti. Those are bullet holes. And we got enough arrow shafts sticking out of it to dry our laundry. We do whatever is best for the kids. Doesn't that make sense? It's suicide out there. We'll die in here. You're right. You could see someone sleeping and kill one of us. At it again, are we? Can it, Carly. Don't boss people around. I'm sorry. Somebody needs to make executive decisions for the group, though. And I don't think you're capable in- We're strongest together. I know you think I'm on her side, but there are no sides, damn it. What about the food situation? What about protection? What about when this place falls? Somebody's gotta be thinking about this shit. How has this not been working? We have everything we need. Because of me, Lily. No, because Lee knows how to take care of people, not just things. We got plenty of food from that station wagon. Yeah, no thanks to you. You didn't even want to take it. Where the hell would we be now? We can't just keep our fingers crossed for more station wagons. Everything that happens to us is another excuse for you to pull this crap about leaving. 
All I want is a week of peace, of not hearing it. Do you know how we got these supplies? Your pal and I got lucky and let a girl get eaten out there. What? Some girl came screaming out of an alley. She had dead hanging all over her. She gave us enough time to get everything we could out of the drugstore. You just let her suffer like what? Like bait? God, what is happening? She was dead anyway. It made the most sense in the moment. Lee's right. We've been putting our lives on the line doing these runs into the city. You wouldn't believe the shit we see. We all appreciate it, Ken. You should be thanking Lee for not shooting that girl. It's not so easy for him. Look, Macon and its people aren't savable. It's not a town. It's full of walkers. And the people who were left are dying and wandering out onto the streets. It's hell on earth. And it's coming. This way. It's not going to be easier out on the road! How would you know? What I know? I know you're not above murder. I know somebody has been stealing our supplies. That's right, stealing! And I know the list of people I can trust here gets smaller every day! Now everybody get out! Happy, Kenny? My family's alive and that RV is running. You goddamn right I am. Everyone is under great stress. All I know is, whenever this shit happens, I'm the fucking bad guy. I'd like a thank you for once. For once! Things are coming to a head. You could say that. Well, I think you did good today. And I find myself thinking that most days. Thanks. It's probably worth following up with Lily about what she was saying about missing supplies. With her wound up the way she is, I don't want to see her paranoid. No question. And I'd like to talk when you've got a minute. Oh. So. She wants to talk, doesn't she? Alright, I'm gonna go talk to Camel Climb and then I'm gonna go see my my girl. That's got to wait. Alright. But you're my first girl. Yes. Hey Clementine. Hey Lee. What's that you're working on, Clem? It's called a leaf rubbing. My teacher, Miss Moore, showed us how to do them when we went to the botanical garden once. See? It's the same. Um, kind of. Ah, oh, that's really something. I'll make one for you, too. Do you like it here? I don't like it here. Do you want to leave? Where are we going? Somewhere else. I don't know. Maybe if I knew where? Yeah, that'd be a good thing to know. I'll talk to you later, Clem. Okay. Oh, Clem is so adorable. She's so cute. Hey, you two. How are you doing? We're okay. Just having a little spat. We all carry guns now, and I don't like it. It's the way it's gotta be. I know, but I'm not getting used to it. I'm sorry. How are you, Lee? You guys, uh, trust everyone here? More or less. I obviously have my problems with Lily, but I don't distrust her. Yeah, we can't turn on each other any more than we have. You need to try harder with Lily. You guys gotta straighten this out. I don't know how straight we can get it, given all that's happened. So what then? Time will come, we'll have to do what's best for our families. And that's what we'll do. About the guns. Don't you start. I just wanted to say, Cat, it's probably good they make you uncomfortable. Thank you, Lee. <sighs> but we need them. There's no doubt about that. I'll talk to you later. Alright, I'm gonna go talk with her. Ben can wait, and Lily can wait. Man, this group has really s gotten smaller. We lost so many yet? people. No, not yet. I will. What I wanted to say was, I've been thinking a lot. 
about you. Oh. I think about you too. I, I sense a connection going on here. Our group is small. You're I small. said. I said. <laughs> okay, Lee. Okay, Lee. You need to work on your. Did killer. Carly. Jesus. And I. Think and you too. Should know. Not because they deserve to, and not because you're a bad man. I think the opposite of those two things. Think. People need to know because we're hanging by a thread here, and I can't see Lily talk about you without thinking it's the next thing she's going to say. You don't have to tell everyone, but think about who you trust and take the opportunity while you have it. You're probably right. Of course I'm probably right. People might be pissed, and telling them might cause some trouble, but it will be a far cry from what'll happen if they don't hear it from you. Yeah. So you'll do it then? I'll let people know. You're totally right. Good. I think it's for the best. Aw, oh, shit. Oh, he's got a girlfriend. Oh. Now, is there anything else you want to talk about? <laughs> Do you feel safe here? Show me a bath with a heated floor in a high-rise apartment and hand me a full-bodied Malbec and then I'll feel safe. I don't know. This place is fine, but we all know that that could change at any second. You really think people are ready to hear about me? It's not a matter of ready or not. There's never going to be a good time, but there are going to be a lot of bad ones. Right now doesn't seem like one of them. But everyone's different. Who knows how each person would take it, you know? Maybe it's worth thinking about who you want to tell. You uh, <clears throat> have any thoughts about Lily? I worry about her, but that's about it. She keeps trying to run things, but it's just not working. I'm going to look into this thing. Good idea. Lee's got a girlfriend. Lee's got a girlfriend. Oh, I shall kill. Oh, I should really tell him that I'm a. Yeah. Hi, guys. <sighs> Kenny, you got a second? I need to tell you something. Yeah? What do you got? It's serious. Okay, should I sit down? Come on. I was, uh, on my way to prison three months ago. No shit. No shit. Wasn't for touching kids, was it? No, it wasn't. Because we got two here. I killed a guy in a fight. Should I be worried there's anything else in your past? <laughs> okay, Kenny. No. Jesus. But you should know, if we gotta make numbers when it comes to a boat, this is gonna matter. Shit. Okay, I wanna tell Katja as well. Can I talk to you about something? Sure. Is everything okay? Yeah, I'm gonna tell her too. Kenny, shush. I was, uh, on my way to prison three months ago. You've always looked at me with kind eyes. I wonder if you could still do that if you, uh, knew I was a convicted felon. My goodness, for what? How much trouble can a teacher get into? Well, plenty. But it had nothing to do with that. It was for murder. Why? He and my wife. Uh, That's enough. Tell me what happened when you were locked in the fridge at the dairy. I was given Larry CPR with Lily. Kenny came in from out of nowhere and put a stop to it. What did he do? He smashed his head in. <gasps> Oh, man. I'm sorry. Everything keeps changing. 
Katya. It's okay. It's okay. Man, hey, that got deep. What's up, Lee? Hey, Ben, I need to tell you something. Sure, Lee. Is it about my watch? I'm trying to do a good job. You're doing fine. I'm, uh... I'm a convicted murderer. Whoa, seriously? Why would I joke about that? I don't know. Um, wow. You're a part of this group, and you should know. I've never met a murderer before. Well, I hadn't, I mean. I know what you meant. Thanks for trusting me, man. I, uh, I... Ben, relax. Okay. I won't murder you, Ben. Like, uh... Have you seen anything weird on the watch? Is there anybody out there up to anything? Nope. Really quiet. Really? Yeah, totally. Which is good. Did you ever come down here to making much? I didn't have much reason to. My parents would let me take the car into the city on the weekend. But what's in Macon? It's kind of a waste of time compared to Atlanta. I grew up in Macon. Oh. <laughs> I don't mean to say it's crappy or anything. Right. It's super nice. I mean, not now, but I bet it was. Is... Oh, Ben's adorable. What do you think about Lily? He's just really she a nervous guy. That's a reasonable thing to feel. I'm just worried she's going to snap. Talk to you later, Ben. Bye. He's so adorable. Yeah. It's like he gets nervous easily. Sounds like Kenny actually has that thing running. I'll believe it when I see it. Go talk with... Lily. Right there. There we go. People outside my door! Oi! I'm sorry. You don't have to. Don't. Th 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 this is the time that they start running. I wanted to follow up on what you said about stolen supplies. Do you know what's going on? I don't. I just heard you mention it. Things are missing, and I could use your help. There's a traitor. Somebody, one of us, out there. He or she or they have been taking things. For real? Who? What do you got? Yes, for real. And I don't have shit. I just know. Lily. It counts off and it's the good stuff. Antibiotics, oxy, fuck, anything with opium in it. I see the count and it's fine. I keep my own. That one's getting messed with. I'm a fucking mess right now, but I'm not stupid. I know what happens if I start a witch hunt. So you want me to start one? I want you to poke around. What's there to go on? I found this tossed into the garbage. Huh. We don't toss out equipment, we fix it. You'd only try to get rid of a flashlight if you were using it when you shouldn't. Okay, I'll poke around a little bit. Thank you. A mystery. Jesus, Doc. I'm sorry. Um, I heard you guys talking. You need to unhear all of that. Can I help? What did I just say? You're the Grace Detective, and I can be Dick Grayson. Your ward. That's Robin. I know who Seriously? it is. Seriously? You can't help. And if you tell anybody, it will be trouble. Secrecy. Did you hear what I just said? I won't tell a soul. The part about not helping? You can't help. <laughs> You kidding me? <laughs> Seriously, Duck? Looks like Duck is gonna help you anyway. Up, oh, okay. Uh, okay. I'm just gonna pause that. And thank you guys so much for watching. <sighs> so that was the start of the first episode.
quite something. Uh, so I'm gonna thank you guys so much for watching, and I will see you guys in the next video whenever I make. Bye!